920, uh, the fun has begun. Uh -huh. yeah. Yeah. And we're talking, of course, our Spinks question of the day. What are you doing specifically and maybe especially uh, to combat the uh, fear of the uh, coronavirus? I've gotten, we've gotten 45, 50 answers. Uh, Barbara Brown says, I'm taking a nap. <laughs> Just take a nap, sleep it off. Leave reality for a few minutes. Just sleep it off. Luann Orr mm -hmm. says, washing my hands, saying my prayers, and going about business as usual. Mm -hmm. Smart. That's. Well, that's uh, what you gotta do. Nothing out of the ordinary. It's Friday, according to Vonda. Yeah. Kids have no school today, so we uh, we're being lazy. The Our kids don't have school. I guess some are out, right? I know. You know we so? have yeah. parents next Monday and or next Friday and Monday, Greenville County. They're out for snow makeup day, so just keep oh, that wow. keep that one in mind. Snow makeup. Well. Bill Crenshaw said, "Not worried." As Jack said <clears> in 2009, <throat> the swine flu infected 61 million. No closures well, I didn't know were done that then. Many. I know I didn't get it, and I, I quit eating uh, pork just in case. I think the pigs had it. Isn't that where we got it from? Swine flu. I mean, that's what. Yeah. Evelyn Greer says Friday the 13th is just like Thursday the 12th, another day to be thankful for. Enjoy that, your day, Jack and <laughs> Megan. Thank life. you, Evelyn. You too. Got a cat in my lap. Cats are great therapists. They really uh, got are. Got me a cup of coffee. Probably going to uh, paint, uh, uh, do some painting today. Oh, that would be She's a good She's carrying one. on, I guess, normally, right? Good. Edie Emery says, making doubly sure we wash our hands often, cleaning as usual, praying and trusting God, and really just living our lives like we usually do. And of course, watch new Chanel 7. Yes. That's the old line, Channel 7. Yes. All right, washing my hands, a lot of that. You can't buy the hand cleaner, though. I've tried. You've tried, and you can't you find looked? it. Uh-uh. Mm -mm. Uh-uh. Does not no. exist. I'm like, if I didn't need it before, I'm just going to use my normal soap. Sandy Chris says nothing, just doing our normal routine. <laughs> Judy Byers, oh, it's the 13th. I haven't even noticed. Well, Debbie says turn off media. Well, they hype everything. Wow. Well, you got to stay informed, though. Jimmy Don't. Sherbert, nothing. Uh, doing the usual thing. Might even go to Midway Barbecue. That's L down in Union. Let's Jimmy, go I don't with, blame you. Let's go with Laura. She's got it right. She's just going to go hiking. Let's go out Go out into the woods. That'll help you get away from How about going to people? IHOP? I, got, I had a gift card from IHOP. You uh, haven't used it yet? For my birthday. No, it's yeah, sitting at the front door. Right? i got to do that. You better go uh, use Go it. hiking. Did you read that? Yeah, I, I wasn't Laura paying attention wants to go home. hiking. Uh, Wait, you not paying attention to me? No. It's called ADD. No, it, I didn't know that. I drift. Hold on, this will help the drift. Go yeah, ahead. your turn to talk. Yeah, get get the coffee, get the coffee. And then Janine Davidson <laughs> says, "I'm not going by a ladder. That's all she's going to do." And don't walk under it. That's don't for sure. Don't walk under it if you if that's what's going to do. Yeah. So well, good. Well, our friend Dan Hamilton's got some homes for us. He does. Let's start with the one. Now, let's see. Dan has a new home. Okay, Dan Hamilton Company, Keller Williams, uh, 2089 Locust Hill Road. That's in Greer, and it's uh, sits on a half acre. Okay. Endless flexibility with uh, work or even, a, let's see, work or living. It's a lot of space. Uh, it's a, it can be a personal resident. It can be an office space. And, of course, either both could do that. The home sits on the main road. That's Highway 256 off the frontage uh, road. And it provides you a business or ample road entrance. Or, like I say, we could, we could live there. Let's do that. As you pull into the circular driveway, you can choose to go to the detached two-car garage or follow the driveway to the back and park under the carport. Pulling out into the main uh, road is pretty simple. You follow the circular drive to the other side of the house, convenient for residents and clients alike. If you choose to enter through the welcoming front porch, you will walk into a bright and sunny den or reception area. You decide what it's going to be. Uh, this uh, area offers a cozy fireplace, plenty of options for uh, you know traditional living or, and again, it can be a business if you'd like to look into that. 2089 Locust Hill Road. I know exactly where that road is. That's you know, in Greer. Yep. Used to play a lot of softball out there. Let's now go to 227 Granito Drive in the D.R. Horton community of Brentwood. It's a like new home, move in ready, gorgeous stone front porch, welcomes you into the sunny two story foyer. To the left, you'll find the formal dining room. We got coffered ceiling, spacious great room, a big old gas, log, fireplace, large windows that fill the room. Great room. Look at that kitchen. Features a large center island stainless appliances, a backsplash and convenient workspace, large breakfast area. If this one looks intriguing to you, or if you want to see what all he's got listed, mm -hmm. you can go to mygreenbowhome.com. I like it. How about one more? A uh, chance to own a property on a convenient location over 15 acres of beautiful land, including a pond, hardwood floors, pines, and cut pasture. 
It's very versatile land. It's uh, near Pelham Medical Center, formerly Village Hospital in Greer. It has quick access to I-85, uh, Highway 14 is close to shopping and dining, and because it's in a prime uh, area, uh, new developments uh, can be uh, added on. And the property can be subdivided if you would like that. That is uh, on 15 acres, and that is, as I turn my page, let me turn my page, I put the staple through there. It is Hudson <laughs> Water Road. That's where it is. Very nice. MyGreenvilleHome.com has got all the info for you. Thank you, Dan Hamilton. All right, coming up next, this is important. We always talk about, you know, leaving our impact and helping the next generation. We're going to tell you about a cool mentoring program for girls and teens, how you can get involved next.